Where's your man? Nipped at shop, left me in charge. I should. Yeah, and Betty wants a word in the back. What about? Moaning about running out of lamb for a hot pot or whatever. She's got a right cob on. Brilliant. And while you're at it, you might want to sort this out and all. Newton and Ridley delivery. Came this morning, nobody ate, so they didn't deliver. Did you know about this? Not until after. Nobody told me. We went to the cafe for breakfast, that's when they turned up. Oh, how very convenient. Hey, we spent two hours cleaning up after your lock-in. Now, have you called the brewery, love? He made it quite clear last night. Your pub, your show, your pub. Can I get the row off in here? Maybe. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do you always talk to our customers like this? I said maybe because there might just be some draft lager left, but there won't be enough to last the day. Well, then I better find the brewery, aren't I? Cheers. Houston, we have a problem. Bad. Brewery can't deliver till after we can now. Oh. Oh. Might as well shut up shop then. I say, covering for me for one shift does not entitle you to an opinion. In fact, I don't even know why you're here. I couldn't have managed without her. We'll open and we will manage, all right? See, I wouldn't be so sure about that. Because Betty's in the back having a strop because you didn't do out about a lamb. Oh, and apparently there's no veg and there's no potatoes. Still managing? Great. I'm off out. You're certainly very good at pulling people together, aren't you? I will sort everything. I'll let you get on with it then. I fancy a cuppa. Ta-da! Just call me Becky Bo Peep. Bringing home the lamb. Ooh. How much did you get? I've got us three lovely meaty pounds. What do you reckon that's enough? Isn't it? Actually, it's too late anyway. Betty's gone home. She got fed up waiting. It was the end of the shift. Right, well, what am I supposed to do with this lot now? Do you really want me to tell you? Will you two last be wanting food? Oh, no, no. Can't eat on an empty stomach. Two lagers, please. Right. Oh, draft lagers off. The bottles do. Ah, a bit gassy bottles. Fancy the webby arms? Nah, drink enough, we'll get used to it. Go on then, you've persuaded me. Yeah? Yeah. I am love a song come in, see how you're getting on. Eee, a friendly face. Do you know, I've forgotten what they look like. I'm going well. No, everything is absolutely fine. What can I be getting you? Uh, uh, an orange juice for me, please. Well, better not go on smelling of alcohol, or Sylvia will have a field day. <laughs> right? Uh, lemonade and uh, two bottles of lager, please. Oh, excellent choice, Shawnee. Bottles of lager it is. Two lagers, please. Bottles, OK? It'll have to be, won't it? Look, we've loads of bottles, love. We're going to be fine. And the older end, you know, Kenny and that. Could have happy with the bitter. And how will the older end be, as you call them, when the bitter runs out? Be you back. Right, love, you can come for me. Get him for a ciggy. Oh. oh, thanks. I just wanted a quiet word. You're bailing. Oh, no. I just want to know what you're trying to do. It's not with you. No, with the pub. Are you trying to prove you can run it better than Steve or into the ground? Just so I know. I do know what you think of me, you know. Do you? I've seen that look so many times before. Scratter who dropped Lucky. Landed on her feet or on her back. Getting her hooks into nice guy Steve. And if I say I don't judge until I know? Let me tell you something. I have every right to be behind that bar and call the shots. Not just a drink and then? And I have every right to get hammered. That's what I want to do. And you accuse me of jumping to conclusions. You seem to think I'm the enemy. But as far as I'm concerned, what goes on between you and Steve is your business. And as you say, you're calling the shots. So just tell me what you want from me. And if I say you that? I'll say Steve employed me. I'll sit it out till he gets back. Yeah, fair enough. Well, Stella... If you want to help me, help me. If you don't, don't. I mean, I don't really care what you think. You're not my man. And aren't we both glad of that? 
Ricky Monster. What's this, a reward scheme? Don't remember you swiping me loyalty card. <laughs> I want you to feed that jukebox and keep them tunes coming. We're having an all-nighter, boys. Sound of always fancy being a DJ. <laughs> um, no offence, like to say, but I'm after Pete Tong rather than Jimmy Savile. <laughs> no, then. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah, you found it. Come here, don't be shy. What are you having? You ain't... This is me. <laughs> Excuse me. I do about it, darling. Bit makes me windy and all. Okay, you have to... Look, there's something wrong with this drink. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Well? <sighs> One second. It is all right to me. Say them again. I do not want another drink in here. I'm taking my business elsewhere. I say, can you have that in writing, please? <laughs> Oh, it's a bit lively in here tonight. Mm -hmm. Right, it's only just starting, kid. Glass of red. Bottle, please. Mm -hmm. How many glasses are we having? Just the one. Not a problem, is it? No. Anything goes in here, love. You want to get hammered? Come to the right place. Mm -hmm. Hey, oh, here he is. Leader of the opposition. We come see how it's done, kid. Yeah, I was curious, you know. I heard things were quite boisterous up here. Who was telling you that? <laughs> <clears throat> Norris, was it? Yeah, he said he was taking his custom elsewhere. Yeah, well, I won't deny it. <laughs> well, you think of him as a little gift from me. You can stick him on the end of the bar like a doby jug. Not a very nice one, mind, is it? But hey, it comes as a set, right? I bet you've got old Emily Bish down there, huh, Kenny? Ah, Joy must be jumping. <laughs> <laughs> business is business. Mm. That is my friend. I've got a drink somewhere. I'm just glad it ain't here. We're catering for a younger crowd right now. Anyway, at least it means we're not in competition no more. I wouldn't even try to compete. Oh, you got a drink. Are you going to turn this noise down? Because I tell you now, I won't stand for it. We'll sit down then. We've got plenty of stools. I'll bet still, stop for a game of darts. Say wear and tear on the board. Look, I'm warning you. If you keep this up, I'm going to call the police. What? Oh, come love, I can't drink on duty. But listen, there's no harm in asking, is there? It's 999. Can you need to write that down? Shut up. Go on, go on, go on. 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 Take your boat, son, take your boat. <laughs> what about you, big man? Come on, you're a long-time decade. Yeah, starting tonight, if I net much more, no. Do you know, you're a... No, don't yeah, run at him, it's a lot of you. You're all flaming lightweights. So I should go down to the flipping Bisto and get Emily Bisher and have a better life here. Boom! I love this one, sir. Turn it up. Jake, come on, baby. Get some it's not right. running. Damage is that? I call cops. Oh, please do, please do. But I warn you, if there's any repeat of this appalling disturbance, they have to be sending the murder squad. Swine. Kenny, stop the music. 